And he said to them, This is my blood, which confirms the covenant between God and his people. It is poured out as a sacrifice for many. And uh, you should read the parallels of that in the gospel to get the full effect of that. But here's the thing God's people, including him, you know, his, his disciples, they all came up under the old covenant. And the old covenant was a kind of a relationship that was entirely dependent upon the law and the perfect obedience to that law. That was the relationship they had. And guess what? No one could live up to it. There were too many laws, too many details. No one could get it right. There was no hope of being saved through the law because no one could follow it. No one, no one is that perfect in that way. So what Jesus does is he says, effectively, I'm going to establish a new covenant. One is established now, and it's a new kind of relationship between my Father and you as people. And it's one, guess what, that's not going to be dependent upon the law. It would be dependent now on my blood, which would be shed. That is to say, this is now going to be solely dependent upon love. The old covenant was built upon the law, and the new covenant was built upon love.